सो गाइज आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल सो इन दिस वीडियो विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट एसेंचर ऑफ कैंपस ड्राइव 2021 और एसेंचर रिक्रूटमेंट ड्राइव 2021 थाउजेंड इज गोइंग टू हैपन ऑन जनवरी 2021 so if you are discussing further if you are new to our channel then please subscribe and press the bell icon for more job updates and the interview preparation videos or the guides and don't forget to check our latest videos joho hcl google ola tcs ibm cognizant and rapido mdocs etc are hiring for different job profiles with a very good salary package so i'll be putting the links of these videos in the description of this video so that you will be able to apply for the job profiles as per year preferences or as per year eligibility before the job role expires so now let's discuss so first of all we will be discussing about the eligibility criteria then application process and the end we will be discussing about the selection process and the syllabus so now let's discuss about the eligibility criteria first so again essential is hiring through the elitmos portal only so from the november 2020 they are hiring for the associate software profile repeatedly in uh, november and december again in january they are hiring for this same profile and only the 2019 and 2020 year pass out or the batch candidates are eligible that means the current batch that means 2021 is not eligible for this job profile if you belong to 2021 batch then you can't apply for this job profile so they are hiring for various locations bangalore hyderabad chennai pune mumbai gurgaon you can join any of these locations as per your convenience so you might be having a question or doubt that we had applied for this job profile or for this op campus in november again in uh, december and again we are applying for this job profile in january also but we are not receiving the uh, interview call letter or the interview test link so i know it has happened with most of the candidates those who have applied for this off campus through elitmus portal so no need to worry about that in the previously most of the candidates did not receive any interview call or test link because they had selected their L uh, skill uh, at java or c++ that's why most of the candidates did not receive any interview call for this off campus but this time the skills uh, skill sets required for this op campus is totally different so later we'll be discussing about that so now let's discuss about the basic eligibility criteria so they are hiring for b btech all streams that means all the non it candidates as well as the it candidates can apply for this job profile and the as we discussed earlier starting from 2019 and 2020 batch graduate candidates can apply for this job profile only an aggregate of 65 percentage only required for this job profile more than 65 percentage is required and it is only applicable for b btech and other qualifications like uh, 12th or 10th it is not mandatory remember this thing and no active backlogs at the time of requirement process that means during the recruitment or the interview going on or at the beginning of the interview you must not be having any pending backlog or the during the onboarding and maximum one year gap uh, one year gap in education post 10th and the other standard till now one year gap is allowed maximum one year gap then zero to one year of experience or rather experienced candidates can apply for this job profile so here we come one of the most important thing so previously people were uh, simply rejected due to this thing only or due to this eligibility criteria so if you have carefully uh, noticed or not in the previous time that means in the november or december of campus essential of campus java and the c++ were there in the skills required list but now they have removed c++ and java so the candidates those who know java only or the c++ only they will not be able to apply for this job profile because the required in the required skill set java or the c++ is not there they are asking for the aspnet or sap or sfd fee uh, sfdc so previously these things were there in the skills required list but right now they have removed c++ and, and java so at the beginning c++ were there and they, and then they removed c++ and now they have removed java so that that means the uh, they have done with the java requirement or java uh, developer um, process or the job profile is full now for the java profile so now they are hiring for three different skills so if you are skilled in this 
profile or if you have these skills then you can apply for this job profile or you will be getting the interview or the test link otherwise they will not be sending you so later you might be thinking that oh, we had applied for this job profile we are belong to the 2019 and 2020 batch but still we have not received any interview link so they have not uh, they are not sending you the interview link because your skill sets are not matching it is also mandatory that or required that your skills must be matching with the requirement or with the requirement and candidates must be eligible to work in India either by citizen or work permit so I think most of the candidates or all are eligible to work inside India so this is all about the eligibility criteria so if you are interested for this job profile you need to simply click on the login to apply and one more thing drive location is online from your home you can attend for this off campus and the drive date is 30th January 2021 and you need to apply for this job profile before 30th January 2021 so remember one thing and if you are interested for this job profile first of all you need to log in into the elitmos portal so i have not logged in into my account otherwise i will i will be able to apply for this job profile so it is not the ph score is not required again i am repeating so in the last time the people who are not receiving the test link because most of the candidates has applied for the java profile only so that's why most of the candidates did, did not receive any interview link or the test link so this time the skills are totally different because they are hiring for Esplanade, SAP or SFDFC so no worries if you have already applied for this job profile last month that means in December or November you will not be able to apply for this job profile and one more thing if you have already applied for this job profile in November or December please again don't apply because they will simply check whether you have uh, applied for this job profile or for this off campus previously or not if they see that documents or the data are matching previously you have already applied for the job profile simply they will block you so i'm requesting all of you please don't apply again and again for this job profile so later you can apply for this job profile after six months so don't apply for this job profile again and again so this is all about the application process so now let's discuss about the selection process so there will be an online test elite must test then followed by the technical interview and the hr or mr interview that means managerial interview so totally there will be three uh, rounds of interview process first one is the written then technical then the hr or the managerial round so now let's discuss about the total number of uh, sections are there in the written test so it is the elite most syllabus because they are hiring through the elite most portal only so first of all you will be getting the problem solving and the reasoning question total there will be 20 questions and the marks for this section is 200 marks and there is negative marking so one by fourth it is common then quantitative aptitude 20 questions will be there again 200 marks and negative marking yes then the verbal ability totally there will be 20 questions and marks will be getting 200 and negative marking yes so totally there will be six, 60 questions and 600 is a total mark and negative marking it is there for each and every section so finally there will be a negative marking so this is all about the syllabus so i hope you get a clear idea about this syllabus and the selection process and the eligibility so if you are facing any doubts uh, any difficulties or if you have any doubts regarding this off campus you can comment your doubts in the comment section below so that will be able to help you as soon as possible so thank you for watching and all the best for your job search